hello everyone <coughs> today i'm going to test on a live websites okay on uh, in the earlier previous video i have already tested the html injections vulnerability on lab okay so today i'm will test on live websites okay so let's start okay i'll just pick up a websites okay we would land okay we have founded the cross site scripting inside this website okay in the previous video okay so in this video i will test the html injections vulnerability in inside this websites okay so it's just a educational video okay so do not misuse this video for the illegal activity okay any kind of illeg illegal activities will perform will done by your sites okay so i'm not gonna be the responsible for this okay so just a uh, education video just try to learn the things okay so let's start i have to find the input parameter first okay whether our input is reflecting or not here is the search bar input parameter need to search the things out suppose if we give spider man inside the search parameter we will check whether our input is reflecting or not c our input is reflecting okay then it may be the chances of html injections okay. even it is a cross site accesses vulnerability i have found it inside this parameter in the previous video and today i will test the html injections vulnerability so let's try to inject our html code okay if we inject our html code suppose you have been hacked okay ready at close and if we execute this html code and if it successfully executed then it is the html injections vulnerability also in this website including along with cross site scripting okay so i'm just executing this html code and i will check see it's been executed successfully it means that this website is also vulnerable in html injections okay and now i've just tried to redirect this code on to the other websites okay just i will try to inject the code h r e f is equal to http slash www dot 
any websites we can give over here microsoft.com okay login okay and just will execute see the login link has been generated okay and if I will click on this login link and it will reflect redirect to the Microsoft page okay so just click on this login page to check whether it is working or not okay see it's working it's it has been redirect redirected to the Microsoft okay so we can work this by this way so till then Thank you.